530, a mountain community at odds with a neighbor who shot and killed a bear on his property. Good evening. This is the KTLA 5 News at 530. I'm Cher Calvin. And I'm Micah Ullman. Wildlife officials say the shooting is justified, but neighbors say the man took protecting his property too far. KTLA Shelby Nelson spoke to the man who shot the bear and joins us live in Arrow Bear Lake with more. Shelby. Sure, Micah, this bear was about three to four years old, and some of the neighbors who we talked to had seen that bear on occasion. And from what they tell us, I mean, it sounds like this bear really tried avoiding humans at all costs. But on the other hand, we also talked to the homeowner who tells us that in a previous incident, he actually had reported to Fish and Wildlife that this bear charged at him. He also says that he has a pregnant wife, a young child, and he ultimately didn't feel safe. I love the bears. You know, everybody here, we coexist with them. It's how a lot of people feel living in the San Bernardino Mountains. Bears are a common thing to see, but as of last week, there is one less bear after a resident shot and killed it while it was getting into his outdoor chicken coop. This is a picture we've obtained and blurred. We're told it happened here on Fox Lane in the small community of Arrow Bear Lake last Wednesday night. I heard like three, three or four gunshots. And then a few minutes later, I heard two more gunshots. That's Mike Coots lives nearby and heard the echo. He says he had time. seen the bear before, and it appeared to be skittish around humans. He would just walk up the street, and if I opened my door to my cabin, he would run. Like, he would not stop and look at you. He would instantly run. Officials with California's Department of Fish and Wildlife say the homeowner reported killing the bear and that under Fish and Game Code 4181.1, the killing was justified. Under that code, any bear that is encountered while in the act of inflicting injury to, molesting, or killing livestock may be taken immediately by the owner of the livestock. While we were in the neighborhood, the homeowner, Chris, who only wanted to be identified by his first name, stopped to talk to us briefly. It was getting into my chicken coop. So, like I said, just go and talk to the sheriffs. They'll give you the whole details. In a previous incident, Chris had reported to the department that the bear charged at him. I thought everything I can legally to prevent this bear, okay? I had an electric fence. Bear went through it no matter what. I had a bunch of other deterrents. Bear kept coming. I even bear sprayed him and he still kept coming. While the incident is justified, it's drawn lots of criticism from other mountain residents, especially online. Many saying that it was sad it had to end this way. Others see both sides. I think if, you know, Fish and Game says that it's justified, then it's justified. I do love animals, so it does hurt to see, you know, a bear get shot over this situation. And it sounds like Chris is going to be getting some help from his neighbors to further fortify his chicken coop. In the meantime, here in the state of California, there are pretty specific regulations when it comes to killing bears. That information would come from the California Department of Fish and Wildlife. Reporting live from Arrow Bear Lake, I'm Shelby Nelson, sending it back to you. Shelby, thank you.